Howdy, boys and girls. Welcome to Kilts of Culture. I am Rocky. This is Eric. Yo. Today, special treat. Friend and viewer, uh, Malcolm Brown, gave us Bushmills Black Bush. Um, little, little minor interesting point about that. Somebody uh, did a research and found out. It's, they just called it like the Black Bushmills. Like, hey, that's someone with the black label, Black Bush. And that's why it's called Black Bush. So there was originally a regular Bushmills on the shelf, but if you wanted the black label one, you said Black Bush. Give me the black label one. Exactly. So, sure. That's... So you just rolled into it and confused yeah. everybody. Yeah. So, okay. I, I think it, I, it could be a much more interesting story. It's not, but yeah. we're going to do it anyway. You know, you know what would be helpful for this? would be a table. It would be... Oh, right. oh, still can't do it real well. You make me look bad. I try right. to do the force powers thing I, every well, time. And your force powers suck. I, they do. <laughs> All Not right. enough time on Dagobah. So, Bushmills, Black Bush. Mr. Mac, if you would like to come over and collect yours, and I'm going to pour it out here so I don't jump, dump it all over myself. Thereby enacting the ritual wherein we confirm that this is not a green screen, that this is actually a room that we spent a gob of money on. Gob. With real swords and a real targe and all that. Gob so, is a, uh, oh, hey, Mac. Well, howdy. It's a monetary amount. Slightly well, less than a, a smattering. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. And I will cap Bushmills Black Bush. I'll get that out of the way. So, Mac, while you're here. Oh, while I'm here? While you're there. While I'm here. What tartan are you wearing today, Mac? I got the uh, the County Limerick on. County Crest Limerick. County Crest Limerick. County Crest. Sorry, County I forgot the crest. crest part. How dare you, sir? I know. Yeah, don't forget that. You misinformationing mm -hmm. person, the guy. Muy importante. Mr. Eric. Sterling. Sterling. That's One of the first kilts I ever got working here, actually. I nice. love it. Nice. Love this tartan. I am wearing, that you can see parts of, the uh, Pennsylvania State Seal Tartan based on the state seal of the great state Hang on, so of Pennsylvania. These are all three USA Kilts exclusive tartans then, aren't they? Yes. You designed I Sterling. I didn't design that one. We bought it from... Oh, okay. We from, bought it. Yeah. We, okay. <laughs> but what about that one? We bought it. But what about that one? The Pennsylvania yeah, Steel. Yeah, I designed, you designed this. that one. Yep. So, okay. Yep. So. Indeed. Mm -hmm. That's... Yes. That's cool. All right. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Hamina, hamina, hamina. Right, down right. to business. All right, Mr. Mac, you have the tasting notes over there. Black bush. Or black bush. All right, so we start with the nose. I don't know why I had a random accent there, but. We start with the nose. I'm full of random accents all the time. All right. So it is overripe grape with light citrus on the nose and a touch of toffee and peanut. I, I, like, you're leading the witness, but the overripe Peanuts? grape thing? Yes, the grape. I, I, I immediately thought, I'm like, hmm, it smells like, like, almost like a wine. Like, I'm getting that, like, church communion wine, like, yes. vibe memory. Okay, I'm, I'm going to say that's the sherry cask. That's what you're going for every time you're doing a sherry cask finish, I think. So it's, that's, that's what. Okay. Yeah, because there is a fruity. You ruined my nose. There's a, there's a kind of a dark fruity kind of a vibe to it. For sure. Color wise, not bad. Not too dark, not too light. Oh, you got a big one. I, I poured a lot in there. Yes. <laughs> Mine's whiskey colored. Yeah. Indeed. All right. Sandra. Sandra. Va. Reasonably smooth. No, not burning the nose hairs when I'm breathing back out. It's a little peppery top back of the mouth for me. Um, mm hmm I agree. See, See, I'm getting no more on the front. You're in the front. Maybe where I just, you know, yeah. hit my tongue. So the palate <coughs> a little burning. Um, says vanilla and milk bottle. Milk? I can taste the milk bottle. It's delicious. <laughs> Collectible uh, shard, milk bottle. Shards of glass. Mm, yeah, yeah vanilla like, and milk bottle styrofoam. sweeties. Dried peels, chamomile tea, and cinnamon sticks. Dried peels? Who the hell writes this? Crap? I don't know, man. They're like uh, super tasters. You know what a super taster is? My daughter is a super taster. She, she has a, a she could pick the, yeah. the ingredients. Which drive, yeah. it drove us crazy raising her because any kind of food, any new food, she's like, this tastes like blah blah blah, blah. and we're like, but you, do you like it? No, it's too. Uh, it's, That's too much. Yeah, they could, yeah, they could taste it's, everything. It's like it's, super sensitive. So I don't. know. I can taste the purple. I'll tell her to become <laughs> a. I'll tell her to become a whiskey taster. Yeah, a sommelier. Didn't say what the dried peels were. Yeah, I know. It's like potato peels. What are we going for? <laughs> well, that'd be vodka, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. How am I feeling about it? 
I don't know how are you feeling about. Now we didn't let it open up. We just popped it and went as usual. Um, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna add a Into touch water. a touch of water, <laughs> which see how which it happens. Disperses the oils, isn't that what somebody was telling us? That that's, so, that's actually why so, you put the water so in. The, just as a note, the the finish is a digestive biscuit, mm. cooked plum and orange oil. Digestive, digestive biscuit. biscuit? You, you, no. have, you know what they're talking about? Yes, I do. Okay. I love digestive biscuits. Yeah, they're just like bland as all get out. Yeah, they're delicious though. Yeah. They're, delicious. They're, they're, they're good with tea. Delicious. delicious. And what's the other one? Or, uh, Orange digestive. oil and cooked plum. Is the plum left over from the upfront old grape or whatever you called it? <laughs> <laughs> Old grape. Overripe, grapes. overripe grape. Overripe grapes are like raisins. Like what do you? Doing? That's gonna be my winery name now. It's gonna be like <laughs> old grapes. Mon Monerson's old old grape. <laughs> the old grape inn. It's a pub name. All right, with the water. Definitely cut the pepper down a bit. Yeah, just cutting the burniness. Yeah. So are they referring to the cinnamon as the pepper? Like is that what is that what they're no I mean, peppery pe peppery is pepper. just a euphemism for it's burny yeah it's a little burny it's a bit burny I can taste the burning the, the old Ralphie Wiggum um, still best underappreciated character on The Simpsons I don't think he's not that underappreciated all right favorite Wa Ralphie Wiggle Wiggum quote what's yours Mac will let Mac think of one do you have any. I just just the general formula is like you know, okay. I'm I'm grown uping, you know. Yeah. I mean the. <laughs> he walks into the back of the gas station, the the adult section. Everybody's hugging. <laughs> um, right. That one or the the wild wolf carries him away. You smell like dead bunnies. Will you be my mommy? <laughs> you smell like dead bunnies. Is there one where he was like in a sleeping in a drawer too? Yeah, I sleep in a drawer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. His dad pulls up. Yep. 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 All right. Enough of my memories of the Simpsons. Yeah, the water definitely. Yeah. Cut her out. It took out too much. Mm hmm. Yeah, I don't know, it, man. It, it balanced it, but it, it's it's much more drinkable. Um, but it it took out a lot. As usual, I will let this breathe and see what I think in twenty minutes or so. Yeah, but, but I I will say this: it's not bad. It's okay. It's got reasonable legs. Um, yeah. Color wise, it's you know I had a tiny bit, a little bit of water. It's it, it's not too crazy dark that it like absorbed all the sherry cast kind of thing, but it's not like super light. Um, yeah, it's not bad. I get the sherry flavor, i.e. the grape flavor. I'm not getting a lot else of what they're talking about. Maybe I get a little bit of an apricot vibe to it, which I didn't really mention, but I don't think is that did. the orange oil. That's probably the orange oil. That's what I'm thinking, but. You say apricot, I say orange oil. It's called a whole thing whiskey. <laughs> exactly. Um, or scotch, but it's not. It is whiskey this time. Mm -hmm. um, it's Irish. Irish. Yes. The, uh, yeah, we do yes. want to say you know, thank you to Malcolm Brown for getting this for us. Thank you. Um, it is one that we've never had before, yeah. so we appreciate that very much, sir. Um, it only took us eh, February is when we got this. So eight months to get to it. It's fine. Yeah. Six months, something like that. Right. I don't know what time right. it is. Um, Mr. Mack, what are you going to score? One to ten. What do you score? I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go like five one, kind of middle of the road okay. for me. Okay. It's not knocking the socks off, but it's not like. Yeah. You seem to you uh, you pick up a little bit more your your interests are more a little bit more bourbon, correct? Yeah. Uh, a little bit less Irish whiskey and Scotch. You can go. Across the scale on. Mm. Okay, five one. Your thoughts? Five eight. Okay, it's not bad. Kind of like it. I, I don't usually go for Irish stuff as much, but it's uh, yeah, it's it's pleasant. I'm gonna go a firm six five. Like really? it's it's I'm I'm pleasantly surprised with it. I'm yeah. I'm not a a big Irish fan. I'm not a big Bushmills like regular Bushmills fan. Um, yeah. Jameson's okay, um, but yeah. I like this. It's a bit. It's yeah. it's a bit smoother with a touch of. I'm not you know, I'm not picking drop. up on a lot of those tasting notes, but it but generally I like it. I like sherry. So, yeah, it's you know, but it's it's like, it's like a it's a balanced 
it, it's not a, a heavy one directional like it's got all the smoke or all the peat or all the sherry or whatever right. or all the oak it's just a good eh, reasonable balance right yeah okay <laughs> cool that's it what are you laughing at over there chief and, uh, no, go. I was looking at the other finish notes here well the finish isn't that isn't much there also no bitter isn't or, much there well the finish isn't that much there but also no bitter or musty old wood notes. This is like notes from some taster person. Not that's not from the company. It can't be from a. Original. I don't know. Their their website is seem okay. to follow that rule. So from okay. just from looking around. So. Okay. So it's just some guy at the distillery who's like, yeah, you know, he doesn't like anything we make. So let's get his opinion. <laughs> just so we're being balanced. <laughs> oh, this is swill. I hate it. Water droplets all over me. Ah. Good thing you're wearing a wool kilt. Exactly. And a real leather sporn. Yeah, exactly. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. If you want to see more of our content, you can follow us on Facebook. You can follow us on Instagram. We are even on the Clock app. Go find us on TikTok. Thanks, guys.